feel honored to be in these situations that I could use my voice and, and do the things I do, you know. Um, it's an extension of my family. It's like the, the things that I do. I tell, I tell my, um, my, um, my family all the time, I tell my grandmother, my mom, you know, they, 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 they're proud, they're super proud and strong <laughs> women, and they, they won't ask me for anything. Mm -hmm. And I say, man, you know, there are times where I don't want to get my picture taken, and I want to eat, and, and, you know, paparazzi, like, take photos in your face and screaming at you and, like, taking pictures and you can't take your kid to the park. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, those are the sort of things that give the reason why I'm okay with it and, and, and why I can cope and live with these things without, you know, a, much as a complaint. It's the things that it allows me to, 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 to do, the spaces that it affords me, the, the rooms I'm allowed to go in as myself. I walk in every room as myself. I don't walk in any room as anyone else. I'm not, I'm not cowering. I'm not speaking soft. I'm not, my voice doesn't change. It sounds exactly the same way. I'm walking as myself and proud, and I speak, and I speak for us. And that, and that, that gives me a joy. That gives, I'm honored to be in, in those rooms. And so, yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.